Hello guys, welcome back to Line Up. For today's video, we are going to show you or discuss with you how to calibrate Honeywell thermostat. So if you're interested, let's start tutorial. So in this case, if you're looking to calibrate your Honeywell thermostat here, well, in this case, there are going to be a few things you need to know here. So the first thing you need to understand here is Honeywell has a lot of products that they offer. So finding the correct steps is something really important here to avoid destroying or even um, harming the uh, thermostat that you currently have here. Now, how do you find the correct steps? Now, in this case, uh, we want to go and first go to the official website for Honeywell, which is honeywellhome.com. Uh, now, in here, you should see a tab for support. Go ahead and click on uh, hover over it. Click on the option here that says visit support center. Now, under uh, support, uh, under their support center, what you need to do is you want to go to the search at the very top here and just type in the following, which is going to be manual, press search. Now, it's going to give you an option here to view a few things, different articles, but what you're looking for is going to be looking for user guide for your thermostat. Click on thermostat manuals page. Go ahead and click on it. Now, what's really important here is you want to go ahead and identify what type of product you currently have. So what model? So in this case, again, like what I said before, it's really important that you access the correct manual or in this case, uh, correct steps for you to find your calibration steps. Again, there are going to be a lot of products here to choose from. So in this case, for example, I have this product here. You could go and click on it. And from here, you could go ahead and basically just download your um manual for that so it's going to go back here so it might not immediately show it to you so in this case let's go ahead and basically click on it it should show you the manual itself so if not you need to refer one of the following options so for somebody you have the spanish english one you can go ahead and do uh refer to that so for example you could go ahead and press this one is one of the manuals available. Then from here on, you could go ahead and search the calibration steps in this specific page. Now, like what I said before, each step or the steps here might vary depending on what model you currently have, but it's best to refer to the actual manual before actually doing the calibration steps because sometimes they can be kind of dangerous. So referring to the manuals is going to be the best thing here. But in this case, that's about it. Hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to your lineup. Thank you for watching.